Students make up 3% of the population, and the National Union of Students suggests this gives them the power to swing up to 10 seats nationwide. Now, there has been a huge growth in the number of people in higher education since the students obtained the vote, with the amount of full-time undergraduates raising from 0.4 in 1970 to around 1.4 million now. A study in March 2010 found that university districts with a large population of students, such as Cambridge, Colchester, Nottingham, and Warwick, were among the areas where the electoral register were in the worst state. With three large student seats in our coverage tonight, Southampton Itchen, Southampton Test, and Winchester, let's look at the turnout from the 2010 election in these student cities. Winchester had an above average of 75% compared to the national average of 65. Southampton Itchen, which has Solent University in its constituency, had a below average turnout of 59%, with Southampton Test following closely on 61. With both Southampton seats electing Labour candidates back in 2010, they'll be hoping to capture the student vote in these constituencies. That's all from me. Back to you in the studio.